The Kentucky Horse Racing Commission met with state lawmakers today in Frankfurt to discuss proposed changes to regulations. Along with the commission, proponents testified in favor of the rule changes and opponents got to tell their side of the story. The industry has recently faced backlash after several thoroughbred racehorses have died. Today was the culmination of a two-year process for the State Horse Racing Commission. LEX 18's Alexa Helwig reports. The Kentucky Horse Racing Commission stood in front of state lawmakers talking about consolidated regulations. They say the changes make the rules easier for those in the industry to understand. It resulted in a reduction of commission regulations from 112 regulations that were on the books now down to 59 regulations, which is about a 47, somewhere in there, 47 percent reduction. Proponents of the regulation changes from Red Mile and the Kentucky Thoroughbred Association testified in favor. Thank you for the opportunity to support these regulations in their entirety. And opponents to some of the amendments had a chance to tell their side. The regulation that, that's being proposed is pretty much straight out of uh, California's handbook, if you're paying any attention in the business, we do not want to follow California. The hot topic was medication guidelines. The commission says there are some people who think they're telling them how they can and cannot use medicine on their horses. The reality is, is what we're saying is you treat your patients the way you need to to make sure that they are healthy. We are defining rules that prevent those medications from impacting the performance the horse's performance in a race or the horse's safety in a race. The commission believes the takeaway from today's meeting is that these rules will enhance the safety and welfare of horses, and that's all that matters. Covering the news in Frankfurt, Alexa Helwig, LEX 18 News.